What's going on everybody and welcome back to a brand new video. I hope you're all well and today, as you can see, we are going to be challenging ourselves to down tell us until we get ourselves a rare broadcast. Firstly though, I want to thank all of you so much. We've managed to hit 900 subscribers. I want you all to know that all your feedback is listened to and cared for an absolute great deal. It's very important that you guys understand that you guys are heard and that I completely appreciate what you guys have to say and what you guys may have to add to this experience. In my previous video on the Arch Decor, people requested that they see some full kill footage. So I will be doing full kill footage with some commentary over the top when it comes to those milestone kills, when it comes to doing my first fifth phase, when it comes to dare I say 200 and 300, 400, 500 percent in radius. Who knows how far I'll get? I've never really learned Telos properly. I've never been here with necromancy. So it's certainly going to be a journey to enjoy. And I hope you guys absolutely do so. Comment down below what you guys think of Telos. And of course, what boss you want to see in the future. But without further ado, we are going to jump into our first Telos experience with necromancy on this brave grind rare find episode so just before we start we've got a system update at the moment taking place and i wanted to let you guys know that i got the zorgoth soul ring which is necromancy bonus damage plus 30 prayer bonus plus five and the passive on this ring gives your necromancy attacks a 5% chance to generate one residual soul stack, which is what we use for our volley of souls. So we're going to be using that for Telos, as Telos does have pretty high defense, I believe. So we want to make sure that we've got a decent hit chance on him. So the Reaver's Ring, I'm pretty sure, isn't what I want to be using. But you guys will let me know, I'm sure, in the comments down below. I'm going to wait for this system update to take place, and then we are going to start this journey. All right, that maintenance is finished. That was a four-hour maintenance. Um, that took quite a lot, lot, quite a lot longer than I thought it was going to do, but that's okay. I'm not entirely sure what I should do at Telos. The highest in rage I have ever done is 287. percent I think I'm going to start at zero and streak, and we'll just see how it goes. So let's let's do this. Okay. Well, that was the first kill down. It took me a little while, but. That's okay. Uh, it took me... I don't actually know. How long was that kill? Does it not tell you? Down here somewhere? No, it doesn't. That's interesting. I mean, it must have taken four minutes something because the instance is still active. But, well, there you have it. <laughs> and for our efforts, four Lantodime seeds. But we are on 0% um, in rage, so we can't expect much here, can we? We're just going to go with this method for now. Maybe you guys in the future can let me know... If it's better to start at 100 or 0 or just do straight claims at higher percent in rages, you guys uh, probably know a, quite a bit more than I do. So hopefully you guys have got something to add to this. But I'm quite excited about this challenge. I'm also very nervous, as I've mentioned before. It's been a long time since I've done any Telos at all. And I don't fully understand all the mechanics yet, particularly things as they get more and more complicated with Phase 5 and stuff. But we'll see how it goes. Okay, and another kill down there. I don't think you guys want to see four kills under 100% in rage. Maybe you do, but if I get to like 90%, I'll show you one maybe. <laughs> Up to 100 blue dragon hide in there and onto the second kill. Third kill, sorry. <laughs> I have noticed one thing about necromancy. I know I'm under 100% in rage, but this platform here with the red beams is normally the one that used to catch me out because of all the stuff going on on the screen. But I've found it to, to be almost the fastest if I play it like like so. It, I just find it to be incredibly quick. You know, with the fact that you can now dive without bladed, bladed dive and stuff into the beam, dive straight into it. And as you can see, he's never getting towards that center beam where he can use the anima bomb as long as he stays low is that right or can it not be in the bottom or the top i'm not sure if it needs to be a balance
And there's another one down. Very nice. This is definitely going to be a difficult challenge for me. I'm going to need to learn what defensives to use and when. <laughs> I'm a little bit scared. But, oh, great. Cheers. Another six Lanternine Seeds. Clearly Telos is not a boss worth doing under 100% in rage. That's, that's for sure. But that's okay. That's okay. I'm definitely going to have to have a lot to learn for this one. I apologize now for anybody that knows how to do Telos and is very confident at it because they're probably going to be looking at this feeling quite pained that I don't know what I'm doing. But keep in mind, I like to keep throwing myself and the point of this series is to do stuff that's difficult for me. If I was very good at Telos, it wouldn't be difficult. So I'm hoping that along with my learning it, you guys maybe who don't know Telos as well can learn it too. Maybe that's something that we could do. I'll go through some of the full kills together with you, especially when we reach 100% uh, enraged for fifth phase. And I'll show you the full kill, not just the fifth phase. Uh, we'll do all those bits together and hopefully you like this. But it just means that there might be less kills in the video. But we'll see. We'll absolutely see. I just want you guys to sort of see how, how I'm getting on and how the journey is going. Because it's definitely going to be something that I'm going to struggle with and I'm very nervous about. Oh dear. I There's so much about this boss that's almost nostalgic for me. This was the boss for me that I used to look at and go, I am never going to beat this boss. I am never going to beat this boss. And that was, forget fifth phase, that was any phase. I remember firmly believing that I would never be able to do this boss. So I'm so glad that I actually can. It feels like, I don't know, it almost feels slightly surreal, I'll be honest. Can you guys let me know as well in the comments, this red thing at the top, can it be in the bottom half of the red as well? Or does it have to be in the middle? Uh-oh. I'm talking too much while not knowing the boss very well. That's my bad. <laughs> yeah, let me know. That beam at the top, the virus bit, let me know if it needs to be in the dark bit or if it can be in the bottom half of the red as well. I'm not sure. I know it can't be in the top, but I'm not sure if it can be in the bottom. There we go. Another kill down. All right. I think I'm getting strategies in my head on how I'm going to handle it later. I'm not worried about the kills now. Like, these aren't difficult kills at the moment for me. But I'm worried about how I'm going to deal with the mechanics that are going to get much harder later. I'm definitely nervous about that. Very, very nervous about that. But we'll see. Maybe. Maybe. Big fat maybes, everybody. I'll be fine. But... I'm living in fear. <laughs> uh, I'm so nervous. I'm sorry I've said that so many times, but it's true. All right, and in we go. Oh, my word. I'm not even using an aura. What am I doing? Old Steel Invader used to scare the absolute life out of me, that did. I always used to think you had to, to soul split flick it. And I just never could. I was never good at it. I could make it so I took no damage, but I could never get the health back from it because there's two hits. But I've learned that actually, as long as you take no damage from it, you're fine. At least at the lower level in rages. I might be talking out of my rear end <laughs> when it comes to higher in rage. Don't take too many tips from me because I don't know much about the boss but I will help in any way I can. Oh, I was not standing in the font and I just hit the insta-kill. That's not good, is it? And I missed that as well. Oh, no. I've just signed because I didn't... I was a pixel outside of the thing. Ah, oh, jeez. It's fine. It's fine. We're fine. It's totally fine. Okay. All right. Another one down. Oh, dear. That was silly of me. That was very silly of me. 
And what's the loot from this one? That's our 90th ever Telos kill, by the way, guys. So not experienced. Up to 56% in rage. All right, let's make sure we're standing in the font this time because that was not fun. Okay. And another kill down. Very nice. Okay. I'm getting the idea in my head of how I'm going to handle the higher tier stuff. And that was... Ooh. Wow. That was that was nice. 122 tiny blunt rune salvage. We're over a mil now. That jumped. Very nice. Up to 66% enrage. Right. Which I might... I don't really know what to use. Should I use Supreme Invigorate maybe? Or maybe Dark Magic or Vampirism? I'm going to put Vampirism on for now. I'm hoping you guys in the comments are going to help me an awful lot. Let Comment down below, you Telos experts, or people who just know Telos a little bit. Let me know what you guys use and what works for you. Because that would help me out a lot. And another kill down. Awesome. Okay. So you can't death mark him before the face is done. He cleanses himself of everything. So you need to make sure that you're, you're doing it on that last bit to finish him quickly. And we've got even more Tiny Blunt Rune Savage. Okay. And we're continuing up to 82%. So that jumped quite a bit there. Okay. All right. In the future, by the way, guys, I'm not going to show you a bunch of footage from 0% to 99%. I don't know if you guys really want to see that. But I want this to be an authentic experience for everybody to know that I'm actually petrified of this boss. I'm not good at it. And you can probably see that I'm not good at it, but I'm doing it anyway. I've had some comments down below in, the, in my previous videos where people have said that they've been inspired to do something more difficult or that they are scared of boss certain PVM challenges. The point of this is to show that you should give it a go and do your best because that's all you can do. But just go for it. Nice. That's phased nice and quickly. Wow. Okay. That was nice. This is going okay. Repetition is absolutely key in RuneScape bossing. Absolutely key. And another one down. Beautiful. Very, very nice. That was much... I felt more confident in that kill. Hopefully that's a trajectory that I'm going to stay on where I get more and more confident rather than just fluke my way. We've got some Onyx Bolt tips that time. Okay. And we're up to 92%. So there's every chance that after this one, we're up to over 100% where I will show you a full kill. Or my first five phase kill. <laughs> I just tried to dodge into a corner. That didn't work. Oh dear. Well, that's a smooth phase. Wow, look at that. The damage in the red beam is nuts. Wow. Oof, my familiar's almost vanished. I should probably keep track of that. Whoops. 
Also, that's another thing you guys can help me with. What familiar should I be bringing into a Telos instance? That would be super helpful if you guys can let me know or recommend what I should be bringing for that. And he's dead. There we go. Alrighty. So depending on how much this jumps, this could be our 100%. We've got some blue dragon hide there. And continue. There we go. Up to 106% in rage. You have reached the gold prize tier. You have significantly, significantly increased chance to receive Telos related item prices and other higher value items. There it is. You read it here first. <laughs> Oh, I don't know why I let this boss get to me so much. I'm sorry I wasn't commentating then. Oh, dear. He got all three of his abilities up on that one. Right. I told you guys I'd show you a full kill. So apologies for the silence there. Right. Come on. I don't know why I let it get to me so much. I presume he's going to do the uh, one where I have to dash and stuff next. Nope. He's doing hold still. Didn't realise that was next. Alright. Oh, we've got a timer now. We didn't have a timer under 100%, but now we do. Alright. There you go then. Right, I roll to that. And then I just try and use all my big hitting abilities now. To try and nuke this face as fast as possible because the bomb hurts so much. Come on, get in the beam. That's it. And that's that. Okay, alright. That's another one down. That phase is always the fastest if I can get into the beam quick enough because of the extra damage you get from the red beam. Okay. Got to drink my prayer. Hurt him a little bit. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Whoops. Kill the minions. Volcanic Golem's the one that stuns me, so I want to make sure I'm away from that. Okay. Make sure I've got prayer. Always make sure I've got prayer. When he does this, I'm going to use my vitality. There it is. That's fine. Oh. I was too close. Good timing, but I was too close to him. Okay. 
Okay. That's the fourth phase down. And now we're on to our fifth phase. We're four minutes in, so that's probably quite slow, but... I can't even remember this phase. Not very well. I think I want to be in the green beam, if I remember correctly, but I honestly can't remember. Okay, he's dead. All right. Oh, I was probably quiet as all hell then. I'm sorry. Let's claim our loot. And we've got 119 uncut dragon stones. Continue the challenge up to 117%. Oh, I'm so focused. <laughs> oh, this is way worse than anything else I've done. I feel like he lives rent free in my head as really, really difficult boss. He's going to kill you sort of. That's my thinking in my head while I'm doing this. So this is like overcoming my RuneScape fears. <laughs> uh, does anyone else have a boss like that? Or maybe Telos was like that for you. Is there any bosses in the game? A lot of you I know don't have this. But let me know in the comments down below if you've ever felt that way about a boss but don't anymore. Or if there is a boss that you think this is just going to wreck me. If there's any bosses like that, let me know in the comments down below, because I'm sure I would have felt the same way about those bosses as well, because some of them are just horrible. Okay, all right. Dodging stuff. Oh, oh I got a double soul thing then from my ring. That was nice. Did you guys notice that? That was sweet. Is he gonna follow me? Or is he just gonna do ma magic? No, no, yeah, okay. There we go. All right, on to the next phase. Oh dear. As much damage as I can. Pop everything I have. Hold still's not a nice one. Get out of the beam. The beam's mine. <laughs> My beam. Did he tell us? Okay. On to the fourth phase. Okay, he's throwing his bomb. He's gonna do the so much power. Vitality pot. Okay. I'm going to use Reflection here. I'm going to use the Ad Clearing Necro combination. I'm going to use a... What's it called? I'm going to mark him with Invoke Death. That's it. That's what I'm going to do. He's dead. On to the fifth phase. I want to get over into this, I think. I need to mark him. We're going to barricade now. And we're going to try and nuke him again. See if we can just keep this sort of routine going. I've got the virus. I need to do something about that, don't I? That's the red one. Oh, no. That's the black one. Oh, he's dead. I think the virus is the black one. All right, he's dead again. What's our loot? Bladed rune salvage. There you go. Well, isn't that great? My minions haven't even come down. Now they have. Fantastic. Missed out on quite a bit of damage there, I think.
Okay, phase one. Very nice. Yeah, this is going good. Just nuke, nuke, nuke. How much damage can I do? And phased, very nice. All the damage. All that damage. I need to look into getting the tier 99 Necro Prayer as well, actually. But that's probably super pricey. Okay. Oh, I was stunned, that's why. That's not nice. Okay, another phase down. On to the fifth phase. Your prayer still drains in these cinematics. That's a bit annoying. Yeah. Why? Oh, yeah. There we go. Nice. Another kill down. And we've got a treasure hunter key. And dwarf weed seeds. <laughs> Up to 142%. I didn't cleanse the beam. I messed up. I messed up. I messed up. I got so lucky there. That was so silly. I signed as well. I wasn't focused on my uh, on my virus there to cleanse the beam. That was so silly. Okay, continue challenge. Up to 153%. Oh, that was silly. That was so silly. Okay. All right. On to phase five. Oh, I'm nervous. I really messed up the last one. I need to be really careful. I don't do the same thing again. That was really bad last time. Let's make sure we do it right this time, huh? Okay, he's dead. Nice. Good. 
We didn't sign. We managed it. Nice. Let's see what we get. Anything nice? Uh, Black Dragon Hide. 6.2 mil we're up to, and we're up to 165% in rage. You have killed 99 Telos. <laughs> we got one more till we hit that triple digits. Well, that was really cool. I didn't mean to uh, use the spell on them, but that'll do. <laughs> that looked really cool. Okay, phase four down. Nice. That insta-kill on that bit is really, really nice. It's almost like once you get to that bit, you know, you're safe for the next phase. But I don't want to speak too soon because I'm scared again already. Oh, I thought I was out of that. Whoops. Okay, he's dead. Nice. That was under five minutes, that one. Cool. And there's a hundred Kellos kills. Woohoo! And we got some incandescent energies. Continue the challenge up to 182%. And there's our milestone. You have killed 100 Telos. Guys, just a very brief interlude here. I was about to stop the video at that point as the video was getting longer. But in fact, what I'm going to do is make this quite a long video. This is for testing purposes to see if you guys enjoy it and whether my p computer can handle it. Um, so enjoy. And I hope you guys enjoy the rest of what you're about to see. And I also apologize for not using my book of jazz, not having my aura on most of the time, and not noticing that my minions aren't joining the fight half of the time. So let's correct those things, shall we? Moving on. Also, if you guys could let me know if you are enjoying the longer videos with more boss kills. I can't commentate the entire time. Because I don't just want to talk for the sake of talking, but you guys asked to see more, so I'm hoping this is ticking the boxes that you guys wanted to see. Okay, and we're moving on to phase five. Oh, the phase that normally messes it up for me, and I've still not got my book of jazz on. What is wrong with me? I keep forgetting things, and it's a difficult fight. I just keep forgetting things that I need to have on. Not good. That was awful. But somehow we did it without signing even. That was awful though. What's the loot? More Onyx Bolt tips. Up to 9 mil and up to 193% in rage. Let's do this. Keep it going. Okay, moving into phase five. Had all sorts of distractions there. Phones ringing and everything. That really threw me off, that did. Oh dear, we've got stunning golems. Not sure if it was the right move to kill them, but they were stunning golems, so I figured I should. And he's down. Very nice. I felt a little bit more in control that time. And we got <laughs> tall still seeds. Oh dear. Up to 203% in rage, folks. 
one of these days I'm going to stop forgetting that I'm missing something. It's just ridiculous. I keep missing things. It's driving me crazy. Feels like I'm I'm the reason that things aren't going as smoothly as they could. It's very annoying. I don't like it. Oh, the AOE on Necromancy is just beautiful. Lovely jubbly. button Okay, moving into phase five. Come on. We can do this. We can do this. We can do this. No idea what just hit me there, but that hurt. Maybe the virus, but we did it, and we didn't sign. That's good news. That's very good news. And what's our loot? More black dragon hide, up to two hundred and seventeen percent in rage. Okay, it's a new day for me, and I'm hoping that I haven't forgotten everything. <laughs> Let's hope, eh? Right. Here we go. I've already forgot my aura. Right. Let's go. Let's come on, tell us. Let me win. First phase down. Nice. We're on 217% in rage, so we're not far off like the highest in rage I've ever done on this. And I am certainly nervous about it. I'm sorry how many times I've said that, but it just feels really difficult. Okay, nice. Very nice. Second phase down. I mean, that wasn't nice at all. That was very slow, but we made it. We made it. We're all good. Another phase down. That one's not too bad as long as you don't panic too much and you manage to kill like down him 
without the beam getting too high, that phase isn't too bad. The moment that beam gets higher up at the top, that's when it gets really, really tricky. Very dangerous, indeed. Okay, we've got minions now. So much power. Heal up there. I messed up the animal bomb. Okay, on to phase five. The difficult phase, everybody. The difficult one. Of course, I haven't got my book active either. Silly Charlie, messing things up and forgetting things. to be in these beams to cleanse the, the stream. There we go, cleansed it. Okay, no, we're okay. Nice, we did it. We got lucky that that beam went to the black one because the black one is what cleanses you. But that's nice. Happy with that. What's the loot? More tiny blunt room salvage up to 11.3 mil. That was our 19th kill of the challenge. Oh, I messed that up. Silly. Well, but he's phased. We phased him. That was much better than the the first phase last time. That was good. As long as I keep doing it and keep learning, this will just get easier. I know that. It's just overcoming... I think I give him almost too much... I He deserves respect. Absolutely, right? But I think I give him maybe too much respect? Like, I'm too scared of him. Play got us. Of course, it moved as we got to it. That's going to happen. Uh, I didn't move for some reason. I pressed the button. It must have been on cooldown. That's okay. Don't panic. And phased. Nice. That I was not focused on at all. He's just dunked on me. That was silly. I've signed there, so I don't have a sign for the final phase. This could be the end of us. Sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I might have messed up the streak already. Cleanse that. That's so punishing.
eat some of these blubbers and get ready for that so much power as well. There it is. Good. Dodge that. Very nice. AOE these minions down. Get some health back. Nice. And we're just gonna eat. We're just gonna eat blubber jelly first because I want to save the Saradami brews for panic moments on the final phase. The fact that I don't have a sign is making me incredibly nervous right now. Right into the fifth phase. Come on. Oh, this boss. I took my eye off the ball for one second there, and he signed me instantly. He was. He had no regrets about doing that to me, did he? Right. Let's get into the beam. Oh, we're not in the beam. My minions are gone. I'm messing this right up. Been cleansed. Okay. Come on. There we go. Very nice. We did it. We did it. We did it. Nice, nice. Okay. Oh. And we got even more seeds. We have uh, way too many seeds. 239% in rage is what we're up to, and that is the 20th kill of this challenge. So there you have it, everybody. That is my very first. Telos attempts and you have seen a lot more content than you would have normally done when it comes to the actual kill footage Let me know if you liked it. I know I've preached this quite a lot, but this video is deliberately Considerably longer. I hope you enjoyed it. There was a lot more authenticity to this video You saw a lot more actual footage and that and how my attempts actually went and some of my thought processes about it Do let me know because I'm guaranteed that there's some people here that are much better than I am who view my videos can let me know if there's any advice or tips that they can give me i know i keep forgetting things but i'm noticing that already so your advice is greatly greatly appreciated so thank you all so much for watching this one it, very important that you let me know whether you like the style of seeing more actual kill footage and until the next one we didn't get a rare drop of course but we didn't get that high on the percentage however we're, we're, we've got a good ground. We've got a good basis. We've got 20 kills in. We're over 200% in rage. And there's only more to come. Even if we fail the streak, we'll do another one. <laughs> we will get that rare drop. Thank you all so much for watching, guys. And I'll see you in the next one.